are. <laughs> At least someone's here today. <laughs> I'm sorry, it's my first assignment and most of my crew is out with food poisoning. <laughs> I told them not to order sushi on a Monday. Everyone knows that's the leftovers from the weekend. <laughs> wow, I'm rambling. Hi, I'm Kelly Porter. <laughs> I'm Reggie's producer. Oh my goodness. Okay, if you don't mind, I am going to sit you down and uh, I'm gonna mic you up. How does that sound? Okay, great. We're gonna throw you right here. And uh, you know, <laughs> I've never done this before. I'm wearing a lot of hats today, um, uh, but not makeup and hair. You know why? Cause Dax, what's up Dax? Dax and I are vegan and uh, we didn't catch the same plague that the rest of the crew caught. Okay, so you know what? I think I'm gonna need an audio level from you. So uh, yeah, just, mm? Cat, dog, penguin. Check, check, one, two, one, two. <laughs> Sounds good. Okay, uh, 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 everything looks good. Reggie, he's all yours. <sighs> hey. <laughs> Oh, man, it's great to have you here. Back where it all started. Uh, it's good to be back and to see a familiar face. You look great. Oh, come on, man. Look at you. You're the one that's look good. So listen, basically, today's gonna be pretty straightforward. You've seen the show before. Okay, well, I'm just gonna ask you some questions about your life and career. It'll be fun reminiscing. And and don't worry, okay? I, uh, I got your, uh, your agent's threatening texts and the kid glove stays on today. <laughs> okay. Whoa, whoa. <gasps> Oh, ho, ho. I see you still got those all pro reflexes. Yeah. <laughs> Ironically enough, that's how it all started for me. You know, if memory serves, you didn't start out playing football back then. That's right. That's my first day here as a transfer student. Football just kind of found me. Now for the Beast de Renaissance. Your helmet. Got those fancy words from this French girl I met recently. Okay then, Let's see what you can do. I don't know, coach. I haven't played since Pop Warner. Okay, football's just like music, kid. Once you learn how to play it, it never leaves your soul. Besides, if you're as half as good as you are in hockey, we're in great shape. Hey, Tommy, give him a ball, would you? You've already got a QB, coach. A darn good one based on the colleges that have already made me offers. And a modest one, apparently. Look, we still don't have any depth behind you. And if we want to compete for state, it's always best to be prepared. All right, suit yourself. You got plenty of room on the bench anyways.
around the edges, I definitely see some potential. What do you say we smooth out those edges at practice? Sounds good, coach. Good, good practice. Welcome to the team. Hey, thanks, man. All right, man, listen, I'm gonna be real with you. This ain't gym class, okay? This is my team. And as long as you understand that, we'll be fine. Got it? Find yourself a box, keep it clean. Seat's taken. Look, man, I ain't playing with you, bro. Don't sit beside me, all right? Get out of here, bro. Captain of the team in the corner away from everyone? Shouldn't you be in the middle of the locker room? Morale and all? Well, I'm just over here for some peace and quiet. I like to get my head clear before a game. But I can't really do that if guys like you keep bothering me. No, I'm sorry, man. I'm sorry. It's just this whole recruitment thing, it's really Stress me out. Thought you had a ton of offers. I did, but they can disappear as quickly as they come in. Plus, if I'm not on my game at all times, I can pretty much kiss it all goodbye. I mean, no full ride to college and no shot at the NFL. NFL? That's a uh, pit lofty, isn't it? Maybe, but I got a lot of people counting on me, so it's the NFL or bust. Well. If you're as good as advertised, that shouldn't be a problem. Yeah. You'll get a chance to see up close on Friday night. Who's that? That's Reggie Brown. He's uh, in charge of the school paper and the social media account. He's a pretty good kid, just, you know, a little annoying. Great, and here he comes. What's up, Reggie? <laughs> Tommy Matthews, the man, the myth, the legend. What's up, Reggie? Oh, maybe an exclusive for the paper? You know, winning me over with flattery will absolutely work every time. OK, I got an exclusive for you. You ready? OK, so uh, so get this. You're, 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 you're really going to love this. OK, so today, I was in the cafeteria. And you know how I usually have a chocolate shake? At lunch, right? right? Okay. So today, this is crazy. I had a vanilla shake. That's crazy, right? I mean, vanilla. Yeah, uh, Tommy, you gotta give me something I can use here. Anything, man. Well, how about a quote? Okay, Reggie, here's a quote Tommy Matthews scores four touchdowns and leads his team to another victory. How about that? Okay. Yeah, I'm sure I can make that work. It's. Better than nothing, I suppose. Hey, if you really want a quote, I could help you out. Who are you, exactly? Uh, I'm the new backup QB. Uh, backup QB? Yeah, I'm good. No, thanks. Uh, on second thought, I need something to report on, and it might be worthwhile for the fans to learn the new face of the team. Yeah? Ask me anything. Okay. Uh, first question. 
Which quarterback style would you say you emulate the most? Well, it's been a while since I played competitively, but back in the day, my game was closest to Patrick Mahomes. I love slinging it deep for the big play and making it happen. All right, all right, solid answer. So when out on the field, how would you describe your personality in the huddle? Well, it doesn't matter if you're playing a game or working a job. It all starts at the top with strong leadership. So I like to inspire the people around me. Finally, that's something I can report on. Thanks, QB2. I'll see you out there Friday night. All right. <sighs> Tommy, you all right, man? Yeah, I'm fine. I just have this bug that's going around. You don't look fine. You look sluggish. It's like you're not playing with any heart out there. Don't you dare talk to me about my heart. I've put everything I have into this. This game is my life. If you have so much heart, prove it. Because you're not showing any out there. Oh, whoa, hey, easy. Easy, man. I mean, upset you. You're right. About what? About my lack of heart. Look, I didn't mean anything by it. No, it's my heart, man. I was born with a congenital heart defect. What does that mean exactly? That means that my heart doesn't push blood through my body properly. Tommy, I'm sorry. I had no idea. I had a surgery when I was nine to repair it, but my doctor's saying I need another one. Tommy, you need to get help immediately. Listen, if word gets out about this, that's the end of my football career. Do you understand? Please, you can't tell anyone about this. This is serious. You can't afford to wait any longer. It's just fatigue at this point. I'll be fine. Okay, I just need to get through this season. Plus, I owe it to these guys to help them win a state championship. Fine. But I don't feel right agreeing to this. If it gets any worse, then I, I'm gonna have to tell Coach. What, and let you take over? I don't think so. I'll be fine. All right, boys, bring it in. Not a word. Well, it's hard to celebrate homecoming when you're being shut out by your crosstown rivals. Tommy Matthews is just not playing like himself tonight, and that is the major storyline as we continue yeah, our play. play. There isn't going to be another play for you tonight. What? We need you to take off your helmet and take a bench. Coach, what do you mean? You're pulling me? After everything I've given to this team? I'm doing what's best for you and for the team. Please. Take a seat. Coach, I don't know what he told you, but I'm fine, Coach. I I've got scouts here watching me tonight. You can't do this. Hey, hey, hey. Look, I need you to take it easy. We'll talk about this later in private. I said. What'd you say, man? Let the trainers do their job. I know you're worried. But you got 52 other guys out there. I need you to focus. They are all counting on you. 52 guys? No sweat, coach. I can do it. Good. Because we're going to need you to ball out. That's not asking too much, of course. Oh, no, I got this. Was it the play calling? I mean, I've had two whole weeks to digest everything. I'll be fine. What can go wrong? Great. With your athleticism, you got this. Hope you're right. Whoa, you forgetting something? Your helmet. The piece to Renaissance, the most important part. Come on, you got this. Yeah, you're right, coach. I got this. Yeah? Yeah, you got this. He so doesn't got this. Oh, 
One more quarter to go in this always emotion-filled homecoming rivalry. Kevin Connors and our entire broadcast team bringing you the live stream action courtesy you of you EA had it. Sports. You thought you had it. Live ball, and they'll have it at the 25-yard line. Start the drive. Here's QB2. He makes the delivery. First down, Bulldogs. So QB2 going to a familiar face there in Davion Patton. It was Davion who caught for QB2 during the tryout for Coach Fetu that earned him a spot on the team. Needing this drive to finish in the end zone. It's first down. Off the bootleg. Here's QB2. Go. Fires down the middle, and it's complete. You know, I got to say, it's kind of odd seeing someone other than Tommy Matthews delivering these throws. I mean, he was basically the face of this franchise, in a manner of speaking. Goes back to Patton, and he's got the first down. While I've got a moment, I gotta give a quick shout out to my man Reggie Brown with the school newspaper here. He took the time to show me around campus earlier today. This kid's got a real future as a reporter. I'm telling you, he did a great piece on QB2 not long ago. Still 10 yards to go after that incompletion on first. They go play action. Maddox has it, and now just a couple yards separate them from Pater. Seeking their first score of the game. It's first and goal from the one. Drops back again. A tipped ball that's almost intercepted. You know, I wouldn't be surprised to see something a little more conservative here on second and goal. Looking to throw, here's QB2. It's caught! Touchdown! Off play action. Goes to his left, it's complete. A 22-yard gain, and that's a first down and then some. Hawks lined up in the backfield. Play action, QB2 to throw. Maddox is wide open. And he'll rack up some yards before he's out of bounds. A 38-yard gain, and a visit to the red zone. Off the bootleg, here's QB2. And that's gonna be incomplete. Took a shot as he let that one go. Following the incomplete pass on first down, here's second down. Still looking to throw, it's QB2. And man, do they get lucky that time. Nearly picked off. But the drive will continue. Man, how quickly things can change. A pair of incompletions has them facing a third and ten after a promising start to this drive. Hauls it in in the end zone. Touchdown. Throwing to start the drive. Here's QB2. Finds his man on the crossing route. And he's tackled at the 41. As a quick side note, what an honor it's been to team up with EA Sports to bring you some of the best high school football action in America. The players will be competing for Heisman trophies, national championships, and even Super Bowl titles in the years to come. Some of them are on this field today. Big stop, Pete. Big stop, let's go! Off the 
play fake. Down the middle of the field, it's complete. And he's tackled at the 31-yard line. A 28-yard gain. And now everyone's on their feet, myself included. He's in trouble, and down he goes. And that will do it. The Bearcats win. So as our EA Sports live stream comes to an end, I'm Kevin Connors, signing off. I'm going to be watching you. Not with just with one eye, with both of my eyes. All right? Keep doing good work, and I'll be in... Hey, uh... Grant Simmons. Recruiting analyst over at RecruitsToWatch.com. Heck of a game at that a nice song. Hey, uh, you ever think about your future in football? Where you might want to commit to? Not really. I'm just kind of having fun out there. Yeah, yeah, I see you out there having fun. Well, uh, look here, when you're ready, give me a call, all right? We'd love to add you to our site. My man. The man of the hour. I mean, you're the hottest scoop this year. Got a few moments for an exclusive? Sorry, maybe some other time, Reg. I got a lot of prep for the playoffs. <sighs> I'll tell you what. If you give me the exclusive, I'll put together your senior highlight reel for recruiting next year. Wow, you'd really do that? Heck yeah. I, mean, I got a lot of tricks to get a lot of eyes on your tape, too. Yeah, I do that for all the guys that are pretty nice to me, which is the kicker and now you. Sold. I need as much help as I can get with recruiting. All right. Let's get started. Wow, great. Okay. Um, let me think. Oh, regarding your last game, what would you say is your biggest strength? My biggest strength? Uh, uh I feel like my receivers would say I throw them a pretty good ball. You know, I got this touch pass that puts it right where it needs to be. All right, well, if you're not going to play me, I quit. Well... Rich, I guess there's your exclusive. Need a word from my office. Welcome to our EA Sports live stream from M&T Bank Stadium, the home of the Maryland High School Football State Championship and the host of tonight's clash between the Brush Hogs and the Bulldogs. Thrilled to be joining you this evening. I'm Kevin Connors. to avoid another mental lapse. Throws left, it's complete. And this will be spotted at the 20. Another first.
first and ten, and even more of a threat to score now. Inside the red zone, it's QB2. It's caught at the seven. And he makes the grab, picks up the first, and moves them even closer. From the one-yard line, here's first and goal. Off the bootleg, here's QB2. Oh, but he can't pull it in. The defense able to prevent what looked like a score. Now just a yard from the end zone. It's second and goal. He'll throw again. Down he goes. He didn't stand a chance against that blitz. No closer to the end zone. Here's third and goal. Off the bootleg, here's QB2. Just a textbook defensive play there to force the incompletion. Here comes fourth down. From extra point distance, 20 yards, they'll try the field goal. to go after that incompletion on first. They go play action. Down the middle of the field, it's complete. A 25-yard gain, and that's a first down and then some. Time's run out on this first quarter of action. When we return, the quest for a state championship continues. Stay tuned. So we'll pick back up with the action here in the second quarter as we await the snap on first down. Batted into the air and intercepted. Picked off by Shillings. Oh, a forced throw, and he read that like... Here's QB2. Completes that throw on the crossing route. And he's got it past the marker. Go first it. down. Go get it. As anyone knows, high schoolers and social media, it can be a recipe for drama. And Clay Rainey stirred up some controversy this week when he predicted a championship win for his brush hops. You can imagine how well that went in with QB2 and his squad. Spoiler alert, not well. Off the bootleg, here's QB2. Another catch by Patton. And it's complete. Goal for the first inside the 10 yard line. Get ready. Line. Get ready. Six yards to the goal line. Here's first and goal. Off the bootleg, here's QB2. He's got it. Bulldogs. 
throwing to start the drive. Here's QB2. And they can't make the connection, so it'll be second down. Okay, so you're hitting me up on social media wanting to know exactly what Clay Rainey posted, and it was an invitation to his championship party tomorrow evening. Yes, very bold, and he was pretty quick to delete it, too. And he stopped at the 42. Hawks lined up behind QB2. Back to pass on first down. He's brought down at the 44. Oh my so the comments keep coming in now on my channel. And yes, I did see Sammy Hawk's reaction to the Clay Rainey party invite. For those who haven't, here's what Hawk said. You can delete the post, but screenshots live forever. So there you have it. Everyone from playmakers to politicians take heed. The new era of bulletin board material is here. Here's QB2. playing too much Madden. What was he thinking on that throw? But the drive stays alive. Looking for another conversion. It's third and ten. They snap the ball. Oh, Patton is wide open. And he's brought down at the 14. A 40-yard gain. And a first down and much, much more. With halftime just around the corner, it's first down. Now from the red zone, it's QB2. And they're unable to hook up on that play. Here comes second down. Still 10 yards to go after that incompletion on first. Off the bootleg, here's QB2. And he's not able to come down with it. Third down on the way. Following the incompletion on second, it's third down. Off the bootleg, here's QB2. It's caught! Touchdown! Don't stop that, Hawks! And when we return the second half of this historic showdown, off the bootleg, here's QB2. He's got a man. First down, Bulldogs. When you look around this stadium, clearly a state championship of this caliber will draw thousands upon thousands of fans, and there's more than a few NFL players among them. Before the game, I saw guys like Patrick Peterson and the Honey Badger, Tyron Matthew, signing a bunch of autographs. Moving right along on this drive. Here's first and 10. QB2. Oh, he lost the football. And the defense has it. They closed in on that ball quickly. <laughs> Following the fumble recovery, here's QB2. And the play call there successful as they get it across for the first. I spoke of the NFL players in attendance here today. Earl Thomas and Jarvis Landry happen to be watching from the sidelines tonight. And get this, Adrian Peterson showed up at Coach Fetu's report. And he's taken down at the 40. It's all good, man. It's all good. A 30-yard game, and they waste no time getting down the field. Play action. Here's QB2. And that'll be caught along the left sideline. Now he's finally out of bounds after a huge gain on the play. One running back look with three tight ends on the field. Off the play fake. And no hesitation gets it off, but he can't make the connection. There's the whistle as we end the third quarter. And after a quick break, we'll return with the final act of this state championship. Goes to his left, it's complete. And he takes it into the end zone.
takes the handoff. Play action. What a catch by Maddox! A 21-yard gain, and that's a first down and then some. One running back look with three tight ends on the field. Right here, this is my favorite part. The spin move you do. Breaking that dude's ankles and the stiff arm, woo! Reminds me of my playing days, Samoan warrior style. <laughs> it's too bad you stepped out of bounds. We could have scored a touchdown. Well, there's no way he could have dodged. Tommy, how the heck have you been? <laughs> hey, Tommy, how you feeling, man? Good. Got a clean bill of health. I'm ready to get back out there. Come on in, have a seat. Didn't think you'd be back. Trust me, I tried transferring. Doesn't seem like any other schools want to accept a perceived health risk. But I've got a clearance for my doctor, coach. I'm ready to play. It's only right you take his spot back. I was just keeping it warm for you. You know, the team seems to be doing just fine with you out there. And seeing that you're kind of thin at receiver, I was thinking that Maybe I could help out by lining up outside. Shoot, yeah. We'll work something out. Like you said, Coach, you gotta do what's right for the team. It's the best news I've heard since my Aunt Lokalani's bore one best in show. I'm gonna get the playbook. We're gonna start drawing some stuff up. Woo! <laughs> I know I'm not your favorite person in the world right now. <laughs> You're not even in my top seven billion. That's fair. Just know I did what I did to protect you, not to try and take everything that you worked for. And I can understand if you're angry with me, but I'm gonna do everything I can to make it right. I'll tell you how you can make it right. The Midwest Prep Showcase, later this season against the Central Hawks. What about it? Well, they're the best team in the country and it's a nationally televised game. That means every recruiter's gonna see it. So what do you want from me? I just want you to let me go out there and do my thing and show the recruiters what I can do. It's my last chance of getting an offer. Fine. But if it's not working out out there, then I gotta get the other guys involved. Trust me. You won't need to.